phase transitions beyond solid, liquid, and gas, unlock some of the most mind-bending and fascinating phenomena in physics, revealing states of matter that defy intuition. Imagine a liquid that can flow uphill without friction, superfluidity, or a material that conducts electricity perfectly with zero energy loss and superconductivity. Both feats unimaginable in daily life. Picture the sun, a ball of plasma, where atoms are ripped apart into charged particles, or a Bose-Einstein condensate, where atoms merge into a single quantum superparticle at near absolute zero. These exotic phases occur under extreme conditions and are not just theoretical curiosities. They underpin cutting-edge technologies like fusion energy, quantum computers, and advanced sensors. Studying these transitions gives us a glimpse into the fundamental rules of the universe, opening pathways to innovations that could redefine science and technology. Phase transitions are changes between different states of matter, traditionally solid, liquid, and gas caused by variations in temperature, pressure, or other external conditions. However, matter can also exist in more exotic phases, such as plasma, superfluid, and Bose-Einstein condensates. These transitions occur when the system's energy or arrangement of particles undergoes a significant change, often accompanied by symmetry breaking or reorganization of particles at the atomic or quantum level. Phase transitions are categorized into first-order transitions, involving latent heat, such as melting or boiling, and second-order transitions, no latent heat, such as superconductivity, which explain the diversity of transitions. Water transitioning into ice is a common phase transition, but helium transitioning into a superfluid at very low temperatures is an exotic example of matter-changing state. Phase transitions are like reorganizing a crowded party. People may shift from sitting in clusters, solid, to mingling freely, liquid, or even to wildly dancing, plasma, depending on the energy in the room. Plasma is an ionized gas where atoms lose their electrons, creating a mixture of positively charged ions and free electrons. This phase occurs at extremely high temperatures or in strong electromagnetic fields, where energy overcomes the forces binding electrons to atoms. Plasma is electrically conductive, emits light, and responds strongly to electromagnetic forces. It makes up over 99% of the visible universe, including stars, lightning, and neon lights. It behaves differently from gases because of collective interactions between charged particles, creating unique phenomena like magnetic confinement in fusion reactors. The sun is a massive ball of plasma where nuclear fusion occurs, generating heat and light. Plasma is like a crowd where everyone has split into groups of positive and negative charges, creating a highly energetic and dynamic environment. Superfluidity is a phase of matter that occurs when certain liquids, such as helium-4, are cooled to near absolute zero. In this state, the liquid exhibits zero viscosity, meaning it can flow without losing energy. Superfluids can climb walls, flow through tiny pores without resistance, and form persistent vortices. Superfluidity arises from quantum mechanical effects, where particles condense into a single quantum state allowing them to move coherently. This state is described by Bose-Einstein condensation in bosons or paired fermions in certain cases. Liquid helium becomes superfluid below 2.17 K, exhibiting behaviors like creeping up the sides of a container. Superfluidity is like a frictionless racetrack where cars' atoms can move endlessly without losing speed. A Bose-Einstein condensate, BC, is a phase of matter that forms when bosons, particles with integer spin, are cooled to temperatures near absolute zero. In this state, the particles occupy the same quantum state, behaving as a single superparticle with wave-like properties. This extreme state of matter is characterized by coherence and quantum phenomena on a macroscopic scale. Acts allow scientists to observe quantum mechanics in action, as particles lose their individuality and act as a single quantum entity. They are used to study phenomena like superfluidity and quantum vortices.
Rubidium atoms cooled to nanokelvin temperatures in a lab form of BEC, enabling researchers to study quantum mechanics at macroscopic scales. A BEC is like a synchronized dance troupe, where every dancer, particle, moves in perfect unison, acting as a single entity. Superconductivity is a phase of matter where certain materials, when cooled below a critical temperature, exhibit zero electrical resistance and expel magnetic fields, the Meissner effect. In this phase, electrons form pairs, Cooper pairs, that move through the material without scattering, enabling perfect electrical conduction. Superconductivity is widely used in technology, such as in MRI machines, maglev trains, and particle accelerators. The challenge is that most superconductors require extremely low temperatures, though high-temperature superconductors are an active area of research. Niobium-titanium is a superconducting material used in the magnetic coils of particle accelerators. Superconductivity is like a perfectly smooth highway where cars, electrons, can travel endlessly without hitting potholes, resistance. Quark-gluon plasma is an exotic state of matter that existed microseconds after the Big Bang, where quarks, the building blocks of protons and neutrons, and gluons, which mediate the strong force, existed freely, unconfined by atomic nuclei. This phase can be recreated momentarily in high-energy particle collisions, such as those in the Large Hadron Collider. At extreme temperatures and densities, the forces binding quarks and gluons weaken, creating a soup of fundamental particles. Studying quark-gluon plasma helps scientists understand the early universe and the strong nuclear force. The Ruh Relativistic Heavy Ion Collider has recreated quark-gluon plasma by colliding heavy ions at nearly the speed of light. Quark-gluon plasma is like unmixing a cake batter back into its individual ingredients, showing the universe's components before they formed particles. Time crystals are a newly discovered phase of matter where particles form a structure that repeats not in space but in time. Unlike traditional crystals with regular spatial patterns, time crystals oscillate between states without losing energy, breaking traditional thermodynamic rules. Time crystals are made possible by quantum mechanics and require careful isolation from their environment to prevent energy loss. They could have applications in quantum computing and understanding non-equilibrium systems. Scientists have created time crystals using laser-driven ions or superconducting qubits in highly controlled conditions. A time crystal is like a perpetual pendulum that swings forever without slowing down. 8. Liquid crystals between solid and liquid. Scientific explanation. Liquid crystals are a unique phase of matter that flows like a liquid but has some structural order like a solid. The molecules in liquid crystals align in specific patterns enabling them to change their properties in response to external stimuli such as temperature or electric fields. Liquid crystals are the foundation of modern display technology, such as in LCD screens, where their alignment changes to control light passage. Liquid crystal displays, LCDs, use the properties of liquid crystals to create images on screens. Liquid crystals are like a marching band that flows down a street, liquid, but keeps its formation, solid-like order. 9. Topological phases, protected by geometry. Scientific explanation. Topological phases of matter are exotic states that depend on the material's geometric or topological properties rather than its local atomic arrangement, these phases exhibit unique behaviors, such as conducting electricity on their surface while being insulating inside. They are robust to defects or disturbances, making them promising for quantum computing. Topological insulators, superconductors, and semimetals are examples of materials that exhibit these phases. Their properties arise from quantum mechanical wave functions that are protected by mathematical topology. Graphene, a single layer of carbon atoms, exhibits topological properties that make it a candidate for next-generation electronics. Topological phases are like a maze with only one solution, 
its structure protects its unique properties no matter how the environment changes.